Cameron, congratulations. Some of your emotions after playing a, a double now this season. Yeah, no, a great feeling. Um, you know, we knew today was going to be hard, and I think it, it proved that. But um, yeah, good to get the win in the end. Was it harder than you expected? Closer than maybe you thought it would be? No, not really. I, you know, all these games are always close. You know, there's always a lot of talk in the build-up to these games about one team's better. But you know, every single game we've played in this season has been close. So you know, we're fully aware of that. We knew we'd have to perform to, to win the game, and you know, luckily we did. The football perhaps wasn't as sparkling as it had been in recent weeks. What do you put that down to? Is that just the opponent, the occasion, the, the situation? Yeah, probably a bit of both. You know, they're a good team, and it's a final. You know, finals tend to be stuffy and a bit cagey, and you know, I, I thought today was. Um, you know, neither team really played great football on the ball, but um, you know, lucky for us, you know, we took took our moment when it came and, and defended well. If I had said to you back in January you were going to win a league and cup double, would you have thought that was on the cards, given where you were at, or was there always that belief? Oh, there's, there's always that belief, and to be to be fair to the manager, I think that's what he done done well throughout the season was kind of keep keep us believing and, and keep a calmness in the group and. You know, we're, we're a positive group and we know that you know if we, if we work together and, and play for each other, then we'll get there in the end. It's been a tough season for you just for the injuries you had at the start, but you feel yeah. you're good now, you feel like you're somewhere you'll be even better next yeah. season? Yeah, and obviously the beginning of the season was a bit frustrating for me um, with injuries and stuff like that, but you know, thankfully I managed to get fit and help the team towards the end of the season, so it's good. Does it make it all sweet or you know, that struggle at the start? Yeah. 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 They're all sweet, you know, not just this season, but the, you know, the past two seasons, you know, everything we've won has been... It's been a joy and you know, you definitely um, remember these moments and same with this season. Cameron, there's been a lot of social media noise this week in the build-up. Is this a Celtic team that's done its talking on the park? Um, I, there always is. Um, to be honest, I don't take much notice of it and I, I don't think much of the team do. Um, you know, we kind of focus on how we want to perform and you know, we're confident if we can do that then, then we'll, we'll win these big games and you know, this season we have. Yeah, I think so. I think it's probably a, a combination of things, but you know, we worked hard throughout the season. I think we kind of saw the fruits of that towards the end. Cameron, you obviously enjoy the moment with the team, all you enjoy the summer holidays, but when you look ahead to next season, you look at Europe, the Champions League, how much of that is a big target for the to make an impact on that? We always want to improve, you know, not just not just in Europe and in the, in the league as well, but, um, but yeah, we know Champions League is a a very very high level and you know you've got to prepare for that properly and, and be ready. How much do you think there's still more to come from the squad and Brendan? No, 100 percent I think there is. I think you know whenever any club, whenever there's a new manager, it always takes a little bit to um for, for their ideas to kind of settle into the group and, and stuff like that. And I think you know like like we were saying before, I think towards the end of the season we did see see the fruits of the work we done done earlier on in the season so so definitely. Did you see, did you see the squad is just going to get stronger? Yeah, I mean, I hope so, and, I, and, and that's our aim. Um, obviously, I don't know what's going to happen in the future, but you know, I, I like to think that, you know, as a group, you know, I know we'll continue to work hard, and hopefully, with that comes improvement. Has the last ten days felt like a bit of a statement from Celtic, just the way you got over the line in the title, and then coming and taking the Scottish Cup? Yeah. I, I don't know. To be honest, I'm not one to say this is a statement. That's a statement, but you know, for us, just to be about winning games, and you know, we want to win, win them as good as we can. And like you said, over the last ten days, I think, I think we've done it. How much would the players want to see? Um, yeah, no, he's done great, and you know, especially when he first came in on loan, he scored a lot of big, late big goals for us. Um, you know, he's a great guy as well. Everyone, everyone enjoys his company. So, so yeah. Cheers. 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 Cheers.